what is it like to be a governor and have to like go home and put your head down on a pillow and be like, man, today sucked. David, one thing I had to do is you talk to the very best medical minds and they give you a lot of reasons why we got to do what we're doing. And my, my job was, and it goes back to journalism, goes back to the Black River Tribune, try and explain to people in language they understand and what that means in terms of your life and how that makes a difference. I can only imagine like the burden and the weight that you felt millions of people that are just like looking to you to have all the answers when really no one had all the answers, right? I'm just wondering like what that feels like just from a mental health perspective. Hey, I was friggin' exhausted every day. And it was, uh, you know, late at night. If somebody gave me some really bad news, bad news back then was say a nursing home yeah. caught on mm -hmm. COVID fire. Um, you know, that would be a toss and turn night.